Hello, this is the first of many HTML tutorials. I decided to, you know, start doing this. So it's going to be divided into two parts. First, which is the main one, is going to be on this channel, and it's just going to teach coding and all that. And on my second channel, which is Z Productions with an O or a, no I in shuns on Z Productions, because I failed. But anyway, Z Productions capital Z Pro. It's in my box, and it'll probably be in a link in the description. So next this is our twitter page so if you have an idea of something we could do or want a tutorial to do, to be done or want us to do something with html um, or help you out or photoshop or adobe after effects anything any other programs basically you see over here and uh, so yeah just this my twitter there should be a link in the description also so now let's get started first you're gonna go and go to notepad and just copy or I guess you can copy what's in the description, but you can also uh, type it with me. It's not that hard. Uh, you're going to want to just basically copy me. I'm sorry I'm taking a while. Alright, now once you got that, you're gonna open up Mozilla Firefox. Uh, and you're gonna wanna go to these sites, imagemaps.com and Photobucket. Both are safe and a lot of people use both of them. Photobucket is a image hosting site and image map tool or image dash maps is a, ma uh, a site that you can basically make banners and all that that are clickable so yeah make an account on image or photo uh, ah, I'm sorry photo bucket I'm so sorry I'm stuttering and all that I, I've been doing that lately I have no idea why so alright I'm already logged in but now over here on image maps it's free so yeah now you're gonna click browse or you can put in the URL of it of the picture and then from your PC it can be really any size you want, but I'm going to do the YouTube size banner, which is one I made, which is this one. I'll teach you how to make these in my other account that I mentioned earlier. So go back to... Nope, that one. And start mapping your image once you have it loaded up. And you got to wait 10 seconds. Alright, continue to next step. Alright, now you're going to be loaded uh, into the the working area. And it'll show your image. And then over here you'll see rectangle and custom shape. Custom shape is for circles, but rectangle is the easiest. So click rectangle. And I'm just going to, you can start on Facebook or whatever you have first. Whatever you want to map. I'm just going to do Twitter since I already have it open that easy. So go to your page, copy the URL, go to back to the map, your image, and in here for a link for this map, paste it with control V. And I would name it Twitter or Facebook or MySpace or YouTube, whichever one you use. So save and basically, you know, you can edit the way the rectangle is like length and size and height and all that make it square and you can make circles again with that custom shape just saying so now what you're done you're gonna click get your code and then click HTML code now copy all of this down right click copy and go to notepad and if you do already have all this then yeah just make sure you have that alright now paste the code but you don't just delete all this from end right there that area to about there that way you won't have tabs under your image it looks really weird but now you're gonna have to this is where photo bucket comes in hand photo bucket upload your image with upload now I'm just gonna go and get 
my picture, which is right here. Once you have it uploaded, go to click on the image and click direct link. It'll copy it when you click on it. Then go to Notepad and change right here on image ID. Go down to source and then change. Go down here to the close quotation marks and go up there to the first ones. Delete it and oh, and Control V to paste. And then now you're done basically. Save. Save as. Now you're gonna type in vid one or anything. Practice anything you want. Uh, by the way, you should be able to download this in the description um, from Google Sites. It'll be a practice file. Vid one, and then all files, and just keep it at that. Save. Um, I've already made one, so I'm just gonna click yes. You don't have to. Now, once you've done that, go to the folder it's in. I have it right here. Click on it, and see there we go. And see when I go over the Twitter, even the side of it, it pops up Twitter. Uh, well, it did. Yeah. And you can click on it, and guess where it goes? It takes a minute because it's not a website yet; it's just an HTML. But it takes you to my Twitter or your Twitter, or wherever you have it. By the way, check out, put your gamer tag here, which is also on YouTube. Uh, they're really cool. They're helping me out. I'm gonna make them a background. Um, but yeah, follow them, um, all that. But follow me too. <laughs> Uh, and message them if you do follow them. Tell them that I recommended it. EA System Z here. So yeah, check out my other videos on how to make banners and how to make images in Photoshop, which is right down here. And that'll be basically the whole use of my other channel. There's nothing gaming going on over there. That way, I have no copyrighted content. So subscribe.